Ooh. This looks dodgy. We are at Coniston. Sunrise was about 15 minutes ago. And as you can see, there is no sun. Oh, this is quite nice. Nice little tarn. I've just had a picture of this little tree just here from somewhere down there. Unfortunately, you can't see anything right in the distance. Uh, shooting at F16, half a second, uh, ISO 100, of course. So we'll see how it comes out. Old man of Coniston. Not that you can see much of it today. I think we might take a look at that little tree over here. A lovely little wall. Let's see you in a minute. Right, for this competition, or composition even, I'm looking at this little tree here and the mountain Coniston in the background. I've got the 7200 F4 on and I'm shooting at F9, about a tenth of a second. This is the view we've got. Quite nice. I think I'm zoomed in all the way, 200 mil. Probably end up as a mono, and uh, let's see what we get. We've had a bit of a climb up now and we're looking down over Coniston water we're on this little tiny peak it gives us quite a good view not quite 360 degrees but uh, nice nevertheless the only problem is weather's closing in Gary's on his phone the weather's closing in and you can't see a lot but this tree here I like so I'm gonna have a look See if I can get a composition sorted out of it. If I can, it's gonna be another one of those black and white moody ones, I would have thought. So if I can find one, I'll see you in a minute. Right, well, we're down by the tree, just here. What I quite like is Constant Lake in the background. Um, and as you can see, I've taken my glasses off, so I can't see much. Um, I like the lake in the background, so just as a bit of a memory shot for today, to say we've been here, uh, I thought it'd be nice to get Coniston in it. Um, I put the wide angle lens on, the 16 to 35. I'm only shooting at about ooh, 30 mil, so I didn't really need to. Um, but at least it gave me the option of going a bit wider if I needed to. So uh, I'll show you what we've got set up. Shooting at F11, uh, I think it was about a third of a second, something like that. Uh, of course, ISO 100, and I'm over overexposing it by just about a, about a stop because it's so bright, it seems to be bringing it all down a bit. So uh, we'll take the shot and uh, we'll see how we get on. If we can get the snow off the top of the camera. So here we go. Right, back again. I'm not sure, but uh, I might just have to take another one at Coniston Lake. I know it's not going to win me any awards, but I like it. Ha, 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 ha. 
Well, it's still snowing. I'm following Gary, he's about to walk across the river, which is not looking too great. So I'll take the lead and try and find him a path across it. <laughs> Otherwise, if I know Gary, he'll end up in it. Right, I think we're heading up that way. So across this little stream. Heading that way to the top and over. Well, still snowing, but I had to stop here. We got to this little tarn. I'm sorry, I don't know the name of the tarn. Uh, it's not far far away from Kelly Hall Town, which is just over the other side there. Uh, but how pretty is that? Beautiful. So we stopped, mulled the camera out of the bag, got snow everywhere, got wet lenses, covered in water. So what? We're here. We're enjoying it. It's good practice. It's good fun. And let's face it, you don't get to see something like that every day. So well worth it. Well, I'm back again. Uh, we're heading back now to Kelly Hall Tarn, which is what we came here for really, but we decided to go for a walk and have a bit of a, an explore and a, a recce round. So uh, a few other YouTube vloggers that I've been following for years, it's just come to mind as I was walking through the snow. Paul Johnson, Ooh, wicked, love him, makes me smile, as you do. Uh, yeah, Simon Baxter, I think it is, uh, fantastic. Another brilliant photographer, great in the woods. Simon O'Neill, I think he's quite local to me, does a lot up Delamere Forest where I've been out practicing and having a bit of a, a do myself. So I must mention Adam as well. First man photography, wicked. 100 degree views and all that sort of stuff. Definitely got me hooked. And I'm wearing underneath my waterproof coat, the same jacket he wears. And my God, it's lovely and warm. We both decided we need a coffee, so we're heading to Coniston Cafe, hopefully, see if we can get a coffee. But, uh, enjoy this it's great so hopefully sort my camera out on some sound and uh, maybe get vlogging a bit better with my glasses on so I can see better so anyway I'll uh, give you a shout in a moment when we get round to to the tarn all right so we're nearly at Kelly all tarn now and uh, I think before I go it would be rude if I didn't actually take a picture of the tarn yeah, let's get a picture of the tree. That one. All right, well, I'm set up, got me tree. I'm going to show you on there. There's my tree. Not a bad little composition. Can't see much in the background, but it adds to the atmosphere, I suppose. Uh, we're shooting at f11, uh, six of a second. So it's quite slow. ISO 100, of course. And uh, yeah, not a bad little shot. Make a nice little mono. It's just starting to rain now, so the little white patches that I got when I just got here on the on the ice have, are starting to clear away, but. I'll spin the cram around and show you what we're doing. There you go, that's the composition. So, uh, yeah, not a bad little shot. Take the picture. Well, 
we're off to get something to eat now and uh, if I don't catch you before before we get home then uh, I'll sign off here and say thanks for watching if you do watch and like I say my first ever vlog been a bit of a challenge done it on my phone so uh, interesting to see what it comes out like later but uh, for now catch you later Ooh. this looks dodgy might have to go across the other way or we'll fall on our ass Come on, my old son. <laughs> Just getting back to the car now. So, watching this car park is a bit slippy. But I'm looking forward to actually putting this together. And I hope it's all right. And the sound I know is gonna be a problem because I've been doing it on my phone. So we'll see. We'll see. tree on the way past never been here before but uh, I know a few people have taken pictures down here and there's a bit of a classic this uh, little wheel here looking back across the lake and as there's a bit of frost on it I thought I'd uh, come and have a look If I managed to vlog this and I managed to stitch it together and uh, I don't know, work on the way I talk and remember what the places are called, then uh, I'll give it a go. But for now, I'm going to leave it there. The weather's turned bad, so I think we're going to head off home and uh, see what we managed to get out of the day. So take it easy. Catch you soon.